My not very scientific, homespun, hard knocks research has told me that successful entrepreneurs and others do something that less successful people do not do. They set and accomplish goals. Hi, I'm Nelson Davis, sharing one of my favorite business lessons with you today. With the new year approaching like an interstellar rocket, we business owners should be setting our important goals for 2016. Today, right now. So here are some things about goal setting that I've learned from my own experience as well as that of about a thousand other business owners over the years. My first real lesson, by the way, on effective goal setting came from the great success thinker and speaker Earl Nightingale decades ago. He said that people with goals succeed because they know where they're going. Your problem is to bridge the gap which exists between where you are now and the goal you intend to reach. I think that to get your goals for 2016 together, the first step is to get them out of your head and heart onto paper or your computer. I suggest doing that in some quiet time in the morning or at night. They need to be in writing so that you can read them often. Sometimes that may have to be daily or even several times during your day. It's helpful to know that the difference between a wish and a goal is that the goals are very specific and they need to have a timeline attached. Because I'm a visual person, many of my goals began as mental pictures of places and people and things. Though it took several years to realize, my home near the ocean in California began with a vision that became a written goal and then my reality. Your way of thinking, of course, and dreams and goals may be different than mine, but the end results can be just as real as anyone else's results. Goal setting, you see, is a very powerful process for taking your thoughts and turning them into something just as solid as that floor beneath your feet right now. At times, you know, all of us can feel adrift. We think that we're working hard but not getting where we want to go or getting the results that we want. A key reason for this feeling is that many of us haven't spent enough time thinking about what we want from life, and we haven't set formal goals. After all, would you get on an airplane if the pilot didn't have a destination and a plan to get there? (laughs) Probably not. The process of setting goals helps you choose where you want to go in this life. And by knowing precisely what you want to achieve, you know where you have to concentrate your efforts. You'll also quickly spot the distractions that can easily lead you astray. You set your goals on a number of levels, by the way. First, create your big picture of what you want to do with your life, and over the next five to ten years in particular. Then you identify the large-scale goals that you want to achieve. Next, you break these down into the smaller and smaller targets that you must hit to reach those bigger goals. Finally, once you have your plan, you start to work on it to achieve these goals, one step at a time. With the master plan, you break the goals down to daily, weekly, monthly, and yearly goals. Here's something that may be helpful to you to have an approach that works. I call it the S-M-A-R-T approach, or simply SMART. S means specific. Describe each thing in detail. M is measurable. If you want new customers, how many and when? A, attainable. Goals come in steps that you can believe in. You know, a billionaire first had to become a millionaire. R is relevant. Your goals should be relevant to your passionate interests and your abilities. You know, as a teenager, when I realized that I would not become a world-class tenor saxophone player, becoming a broadcaster became my number one goal. Timely. When do you want to get that degree or open the store? It goes from a dream to a real goal when you give it a timeline. That's the smart approach to goal setting. Remember also that accountability is everything. And if you've ever set a goal and failed to accomplish it, then a lack of accountability may be the reason. I'm Nelson Davis, and I want to help you succeed in this entrepreneurial world. 